Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Silverado Man 61 here. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. This is part two of Tomcat Rodent Repellent. Since I got such a uh, good response off my first video, I think it's up to like 70 or 80,000 views now. Um, this video, part two, is uh, going to be about questions and answers that I've gotten since I posted my first video in part one. And by the way, at the end of this video, um, I'll leave the, uh, the video part of part one will pop up on your lower left hand side. So, and in the cards. So if you want to see part one, so it shouldn't be too hard to find. Uh, but I've been getting some questions and answers <clears throat> on, on this stuff. It's for mice and rats. Uh, basically it's a rodent repellent. Um, I've had good uh, good reviews on it. I've had bad reviews. People commenting that it hasn't worked for them. Some people have commented that it has worked for them. I know it has worked for me. Um, I had mice in my um, attic in my house here, and because um, I heard scratching and stuff on the ceiling at night, and um, I haven't been hearing it lately since I've been using this product. But uh, one question I've been getting in the comments is that, uh, can I spray this inside my house where I live? And I would very, very do not recommend that. Um, I have one gentleman in the comments, you can probably read it down below on, in my first video, part one, that he sprayed it, he sprayed it in his kitchen um, inside his cabinets and all around inside the kitchen where he had mice and he was complaining to me that he had to go outside and sit on the deck because the strong the, the smell was so strong that it was burning his eyes and his nose and stuff um, let me repeat something to everybody right now do not spray this stuff in your living area in your bedroom in your bathroom anywhere like that this is made for your attic outside around your um, perimeter of your house or the, your garage inside your garage i would not spray this downstairs where you live or inside your living um your living area it's not meant for that so um i highly highly wouldn't re recommend spraying this inside your house because you're i can tell you right now this stuff is very strong the ingredients in it is like mint. Uh, let, me get, let me get the see what the ingredients here: peppermint oil, cinnamon oil, garlic oil. So it is very strong. If you have, if you have mice or rodents down in your living area, call an exterminator. That's my best advice to you. Um, do not spray this downstairs anywhere where you're living or where you can breathe this stuff. I can tell you right now, when I use this stuff in my attic. In both my attics and my house here, I, it's so strong that I can smell it downstairs after I close up the attics and stuff like that. So that's my one recommendation to you. Um, I had another person comment, can they spray this in your car engine? No, do not spray this around your car engine unless the car is not running, is abandoned, or if you have something like, I guess the guy was out, he had his cars out in his barn that were old cars and stuff like that um i would still not recommend it but uh, if the cars aren't running well i don't see any problem with that but if you have a running car that you're driving and stuff like that do not spray this in the engine compartment if you have mice in there just don't do that please um another one another lady uh commented that uh it didn't work for her you have to be i have to tell you about this stuff you have to when you go buy this stuff buy two or three cans of it and I believe it even comes in gallon um, gallon jugs now where you can buy. I bought this at Lowe's. Um, you, you can get it at Home Depot also. But um, don't, be, don't be shy with this stuff. If you have mice in your attic or in your uh, garage or anything like that, don't be shy. Spray it heavily around all the areas where you think they're coming in and stuff like that. So... Um, but, but for me, it's been a pretty good product. I basically just use it in my attic. Um, when it gets cold, uh, when winter shows up, uh, the, the mice, 
uh, would get up in my attic. My, I think I solved the problem now. There were some openings around my garage that led up to my attic, and so I haven't had any problems since, but I still spray this stuff up there about once every 30 to 45 days. It says to use this. And, uh, and by the way, I'm not being paid by this company for this product or anything. I usually, when I find a product that I, I believe in, I'll, I'll put it up on my channel here, stuff like that. I wish they would uh, get a hold of me and um, pay me for promoting this product, but uh, it's not about that. It's about helping you guys out there. So anyway, if you guys are thinking about buying this stuff, it does work for me. Um, but like I said, the first thing I would do is spray it around the perimeter of your house outside, um, around the, uh, you know, where your foundation is, and in your garage or in your attic. Do not spray it in your bedroom, in your bathrooms, in your cabinets, in your kitchen, and stuff like that, because it will burn your eyes and it will burn your nose. That's how strong it is. But anyway, guys, I hope I answered some questions. If you have anybody out there have any questions about this product, leave it in the comments down below, and I will get back to you. I've got, tried to get back to everybody that left a comment in part one. And, and it's part two here. If you have any comments or questions, don't be afraid to put it down there in the comments, and I will get back to you as soon as I get a, um, you know, as soon as I see your question or answer. But, um, yeah. I highly recommend this. And like I said, uh, basically my channel is a car channel. I, I, I Once in a while I'll put a product on that I believe in. And this is one of them. So uh, I would greatly appreciate if you liked the video and uh, subscribe to the channel if you want. If you love cars and stuff like that. And I do other some, some other things on there too. So Anyway, guys, there you go. Everybody out there, have a nice day. Like I said, questions or comments, leave them down below. Like the video, subscribe, and uh, see you in my next video. Catch you all later.